So the narrative of black people in the United States was, you know, you came from these primitive, savage people who had no history, and everything you are, we made you. Strip the African of his knowledge of himself. You can then replace that knowledge with any falsification of consciousness you desire. Once you take from me my knowledge of myself, you can then tell me those lies. To get someone to actually think that someone else is inferior, you have to raise that type of mentality to a religious level. America has done all of these terrible things to black people, and then they complain when we do it to ourselves. We're mirroring what they have always done to us since we got off those boats. It's easy to sit up somewhere and talk with black people about black people, but it's not so easy to have to sit up and look at white people face and talk to them about white people. Now that's what I know. See, white ain't a color, it's an attitude. And you got to have big bucks to be an attitude. My mom used to say, you darker, work harder. But you, the darker you are, the harder you have to work, the smarter you have to be. Folks were breastfed on racism. Breastfed on it. If you're talking about a problem in the world and you're not dealing with white supremacy, you ain't talking about the problem. There's never been a real dialogue in America about race because whenever we start to talk about race, the conversation will venture into, well, what's wrong with black people? White people did whatever they wanted to do to black people. So what are the rules?